So what's interesting about this uh, fake behind the scenes is that, you know, when you're actually on the set of a stop motion animated film, the puppets, of course, are not animated because it takes days, if not weeks and months sometimes to create every single shot, painstakingly animating every puppet. In this piece, what we wanted to do is put the viewer on the set, but really in the world of the animated characters while still getting simultaneously a glimpse at the making of that scene. Since we're shooting at 360 degrees, we would inevitably see what's behind the set. And that, that turned out to be great in our case because when you're in the experience, if you look in front of you, you're essentially immersed in the world of the dogs. But as you turn around, you get to see what went into the making of that scene. What was really mind-blowing, and which I, I had no idea, is that uh, in his animated projects, so from Fantastic Mr. Fox to the new Isle of Dogs, as well as the Isle of Dogs uh, behind the scenes uh, experience we created with him, uh, Wes himself will actually record himself performing every character in the experience. So our latest piece is a uh, documentary series, a VR documentary series called Space Explorers. It's in two parts. Part one is uh, right here behind me, and uh, it's uh, 20 minutes. Each episode is 20 minutes. It's a project we did in collaboration with NASA and SpaceX, uh, as well as the Russian space program Roscosmos, and uh, features the voice of Brie Larson. A few months ago, we were going to film a um, SpaceX rocket launch. We had already re uh, shot a rocket launch in Russia, and we, you know, we'd taken safe precautions and put the camera quite a distance away, not to damage the camera. Uh, in this case, however, we wanted to do something different. The people at SpaceX were, uh, I want to say, kind, maybe crazy enough to uh, to let us uh, get as close as we wanted, pretty much, with our camera, and uh, we decided, okay, we're gonna we're gonna put one of our cameras at risk. If we lose it, we lose it. At least we'll get a great shot, or we'll hopefully get a great shot. And we ended up putting uh, our camera right across from the rocket. So basically the structure that is right in front of uh, the, uh, the the SpaceX rocket. And we we, sh we shot from there. Um, we made sure to to have uh, all the data recorded, you know, safely, uh, you know, further from the camera. We did get the shot. The camera was damaged in the process, but it is definitely one of the most, uh, one of the craziest shots we've, we've ever done in VR. Thank you.